New report could make area engineers take a closer look at certain roads. News 18's Kelly Roberts explains the report detailing fatal wrecks. Five years of fatal wrecks in Tippecanoe County are detailed in a nine-page report. It says 77 people died in crashes from 2008 to 2012. Transportation planner Doug Pode created the analysis using crash reports from the 64 wrecks that ended in deaths. What month it occurred? What, what were the time of days that they occurred? We looked at what were the primary causes of the crashes. We also looked at weather conditions. We also looked at pavement conditions. The report was presented to county law enforcement and engineers Tuesday. Pode says it is a reference for them. Now they can decide if anything needs to be changed. And then if they would like to do, uh, have us do a more in-depth analysis for each, like a specific intersection, we can do that. And from that, then they can base uh, sound uh, judgments and possibly, I don't know, maybe come up with the project. Every wreck in the report has a determined cause. The most common causes are unsafe speed and driving left of center. Both caused 11 wrecks in the five years. Drugs and alcohol were factors in 40% of the crashes. Many, many years ago we called them accident reports, but we then changed to call them simply crash analysis or crash reports. And it's interesting because when you're looking at reading each individual report, they do list a cause, a primary circumstance. Pode says the wrecks were spread throughout the county. Two happened at US 52 and Morehouse Road. While compiling the information, Pode found something that struck him. The one interesting note that really jumped out was June of last year. There was a considerably more crashes with fatalities that occurred that month than any other um, over the five-year period. Ten of the 16 wrecks that occurred in the month of June happened in 2012. The report was only until 2012, so fatal wrecks in 2013, like the one last week here on US 231, will not be looked at for another few years. Next, the team will put together a report about fatal bicyclist wrecks. Reporting in Tippecanoe County, Kelly Roberts, News 18.